A DJ on Facebook named Jay Taylor built this cool little ceremony system. He used some stuff that he had. He repurposed an old TV ceiling hanging mount, and he also used a tripod along with his laptop computer and a powered speaker with a certain degree of mixer controls on the back of it to create this cool little concept. Well, I saw this picture and I thought I'd expand on it and build one out of Global Trust America stock. What we've done is we've taken a 20 inch base plate and a 12 inch top plate. We've also taken a stick of truss and a GT shell for our laptop stand. Now a lot of people have the criticism of, you know, that speaker on top of the totem may be a little dangerous. Well, that's true. However, Global Trust America does have a base plate for F34 truss with a speaker mount on it. I just don't have one to show you, but we did see it at NAMM and it looks like a pretty cool product. I'd like to get my hands on a pair of those. I think they come in handy at gigs later on down the road. So it's just a concept and it's an idea. Now one thing I will say is I'm not showing this to you because I think this would be a real practical solution for a lot of people who want to build a small ceremony system. Let's face it, this stuff isn't exactly budget. It costs money. However, if you're already running some Global Trust America stock, let's say that you already plan on running totems with speaker mounts on top for your speakers. Or alternately, you're just running totems period. All you really have to do is add one of these GT shelves and you have your ceremony system. So it didn't really cost you much. If you buy it for just one thing, you might not be able to justify the cost. However, if you realize that there are so many different ways that you can use some of the products from Global Trust America, you'll soon start to realize, you know, it's all about your imagination. You can use the same kit for probably 20 different setups. So here's just an idea for a ceremony setup made out of Global Trust America. If you have any questions or answers, let me know in the comment section. Until next time, practice and enjoy.